What's going on guys, Billy here, and today I'm going to show you how to calibrate the visual positioning system or VPS on the Mavic Pro. When I say VPS, I am referring to the optical avoidance sensors on the front and on the bottom of the drone. And if they start to act up, you can always do this method to try and recalibrate them. Now, if there's nothing wrong with the sensors, and if they're acting perfectly fine, there's really no reason to do this in the first place. But you can give it a try if you want to, just to get the hang of it. The first step is to download the assistant software off of DJ's website. You can do this by clicking the link in the description below to be taken to this page that I have on the screen. We have three separate files. These two on top are for Windows, and this one on the bottom is for Mac. So click whichever one will apply to the device that you're using, and then from there, walk through the steps and install the software. Next, we need to plug our Mavic into the computer via a micro USB cable. The micro USB port is right behind the back left leg on the Mavic Pro, hidden underneath of this flap. Heading back over to the desktop, we can go ahead and open our assistant software, and then from there, turn on the Mavic Pro. Once the Mavic is finished booting up and has been detected by the software, we can go ahead and click on the desired device. Once inside of the software, we have plenty of different tabs to choose from on the left side, but the one that we're looking for is calibration. From here, it walks us through a fairly short tutorial. First of all, we need to make sure the drone is facing the screen. Next, we need to aim for the boxes. And finally, it shows us an incorrect alignment method. Once we hit start calibration, we can finally begin calibrating the VPS of the Mavic Pro. So as you can see, right now there's a green box on the screen. We need to match the red box from the Mavic Pro up with the green box in order to begin. Once the red box turns blue, we can go ahead and begin hitting the other little blue boxes that are around the screen. One problem that I have encountered while trying to calibrate the VPS of both my drones, both the Phantom 4 Pro and the Mavic Pro, is that you can't use an external monitor. And I'm not sure if it's just my setup that's not working, but for some reason, when I tried to use the big monitor on my desk, it wouldn't work. I had to be using my laptop. Once we're finished with that first process, we'll need to back the drone up and do the same exact thing, just from a farther distance. For the sake of time, I'm going to speed through this part. Just a quick heads up, if you guys do come across this error message, don't worry, you didn't mess anything up. All you need to do is just restart the part that you're on. You don't need to start all the way from the beginning. Once finished with both parts, for the forward optical avoidance sensors on the Mavic, we can go ahead and flip to the ones underneath and do the same exact thing. Once we're finished hitting those little blue boxes, we need to set the drone down and let it finish its calibration. This could take a couple of minutes, so just be patient. Once this hits 100%, you're good to go. All you need to do is restart your drone, and you should be good. From there, you can test out the VPS, make sure it's working right, and if it's not, you could always try calibrating again. And if this doesn't work, there might be something wrong with your drone, so you should probably contact DJI. But anyway, this video is coming to an end. Make sure to leave a like if you liked, and subscribe if you're new around here, as I have been trying to upload daily. Also, make sure to leave a comment down below, let me know if you have any questions whatsoever, and I'll try to get back to you guys as soon as possible. But as I said, this video is coming to an end, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace!